So the other thing that we can think about when we compare fractions is to think about how they compare to a landmark fraction. So what's a landmark fraction? It's one of those, it's a number that's easy to see, it's easy for us to recognize. Um, so you can think about this, is that if you're thinking about a whole, you can easily see in the picture that this would be the whole cake and the shaded part would be less than a whole. And then this would be equal to a whole. And you could even have fractions that are more than a whole. So if we added one more fourth down here. Here, let's do that. Let's see what that would look like. Okay. If we had another cake, and that other cake were also cut into fourths, but we only had this part, now we would have, now we would have one-fourth, two-fourths, three-fourths, four-fourths, and five-fourths. So let's write, what would that look like? Five-fourths. And that would be a fraction that would be larger than a whole. 